Hello everyone. This is Mahesh from ENH I Secure. Let's discuss a small demo on NELM. Here I will explain you in detail how we can onboard user to NELM from admin perspective, sub-admin perspective, and who are managing non-employee lifecycle management source and how the reviewers are approving the request. And coming to the admin perspective, let me log into the admin portal. In admin portal, in the connection sources, we are able to see all the sources which are configured in the sale point tenant. Here, let me open NELM source. Click on view and edit configurations. In the configurations, source name we have to provide, description, source owner, governance group for source management, and who should manage these accounts. Here we can add maximum of 10 users and who should can review these accounts. Here we can provide three level of reviewers. If reviewer one is approved, it will go to reviewer two. If the reviewer two is approved, it will go to reviewer three. Here I have added only one level of reviewer. Coming to the account schema, here up to end date, these eight attributes are static attributes. We can't add hint and we can't uh, change these attributes as well. Here ID is the custom attribute we have created. Here we can change the attribute and we can add the hint and uh, we can add the description as well. If it is a mandatory attribute, we can mark it as required. And coming to the connections, in the connections, we are able to see which identity profile is connected with this NELM source. Here, we are able to see identity profile name and here, how many identities are present in that identity profile. And coming to the accounts, here, we are able to see how many accounts are present in NELM and here, we can onboard users via single account or bulk upload here from click if you click on add account there the two options are there one is add account by single account and second one option is the bulk upload if you click on add account you have to fulfill all the details and you have to click on the add account let me add one test user search for the manager in the manager drop down list we have to add the start date and end date and id and click on add account if you want to add one more account here tick mark this and add one more account We have to add one more account details over here. I'm adding only one account request. From here as well, we can onboard the users, but it will go to the reviewer flow. Here in the configurations, we are able to see the who, who all are the reviewers. Here I have added only one level of reviewer. NELM 1003, I have added as a reviewer. Let me request one account. Account request. Let me add one test user. Search for the manager. 
uh, how can the start date and end date you have to provide the id and click on submit in the request you can see that it went to the nelm 1003 this user has to approve the request let me open nelm 1003 just now i have logged into nelm 1003 for this user he is the reviewer for nelm here you can see here in my approvals one approval is pending if you click on that it will show that non-employee account and who is requested and a recipient as well we can check the details as well for this user for example user unique identifier is nelm 005 first name is sale point 5 and uh, last name mobile number and email manager start date end date and id if you want to approve we can approve if you want to deny we can deny the request let me approve the request if you approve the request the account will be created in the nelm let me check from the admin perspective when we are checking from admin perspective in the account request sale point 5 at the rate test is approved and the identity is created in the nlm here and let's move towards the bulk upload let me download the template and let me add the data in the bulk upload this is the template for nlm to upload the accounts in the NELM. Let me add accounts. I have added two accounts. One is NELM 006 and one more is NELM 007. Here, let me save this file and let me re-upload to the tenant. This is the template for uh, NELM bulk upload. Let me add uh, two users in this. Here I have added two users. One is NELM0010 and the NELM0011. Let me add this data through tenant. Let me upload. Click on add accounts, select bulk upload and select the file and open the file. And then you will get one notification. Your file is being uploaded. This will take a while and uh, you will get one notification once the file is uploaded. Once let me refresh the page once the accounts are created or not. Here NELM0010 and uh, NELM0011 is created in the NELM. Let me move towards the uh, who are managing the non-employee. From their perspective let's see how to add the accounts in NELM. Just now I log into who are managing the non-employee source NELM1001. Here we have not yet provided the admin and the sub-admin access. In the down, we are able to see that manage non-employee source. If we click on that, here we are able to see NELM061. From here, we are able to see all the accounts and uh, requested accounts. And if you click on the accounts, we are able to extend the end date as well. For example, let's consider NELM001. I want to extend the end date. From here, we can extend the end date and uh, click on save. NELM0001 end date is updated. If you want to add any account from the request account, let me add one test user. Add the contractor mail ID here. Let me search for the manager and add the start date and end date.
ID as well. And click on add account. The account is requested successfully. If you click on the add request, account request, here you are able to see that uh, waiting for the approval by NELM1003. Let me check from uh, NELM1003 and let me approve the request. Just now I have logged into NELM1003. He is the reviewer. Uh, in the approval step, it's showing one pending approval. Let me click on this. Here, uh, non employee account and uh, requested by NELM1001 and recipient name. And uh, you want to see the all the details, click on here. You are able to see all the details and uh, any uh, unique identifier, first name, last name, phone number, email, manage the start date and end date and ID. If you want to approve the request, approve. If you want to deny the request, deny. Let me approve the request and let me check from the reviewer's process whether the ID is created in the NELM source or not. Let me approve the request and let me let me check the whether NELM account is created or not. Let me refresh the page and let me check. Here it is approved and let me check whether the account is created in NLM or not. Here NLM0014 is created and uh, let's move towards the user perspective whether the user is able to see this uh, non-employee source or not. Just now I log into NLM1004. He is the end user. If you click on the manage non-employee here he is unable to see the NLM source. From request center, he want to request for any target applications, he can request. For NELM, there is no option for the request an account from the request center. Thank you. Please follow the below social media pages for other updates.